Okay, hello everyone. Um, in this video I'll be showing you how to make a simple water effect in GIMP. And and no, as you see here, this is not what I've actually made. This is actually a desktop background I've set as my background off the internet. But anyway, I'm rambling a little too much. Uh, I'll go ahead and get started. First, go to File, New, Create an Image, Image Size is 640 by 400, and my Events Options, the background is filled with background, so that'll be white. I'm going to zoom in, and then I'm go to actually um, going to make a new layer fill with transparency excuse me uh, this is really late so <laughs> I'm not very good at these late videos but anyway um, go to your paintbrush tool and click the paintbrush tool then scroll down to where you see the sparks brush click that and then go to your blend tool and where it says gradient go down to where you see the horizon 2 and click that as you see I already had it clicked so but anyway, um, then go back to your paintbrush tool and click Use Color from Gradient. Now, I'm going to just simply make some simple design. Okay, so after you make your design, uh, now go to Filters with that layer selected. Go to Filters, Map, Displace, and you'll see this, this window box appear. I'm going to make it larger so you can actually tell what I'm doing. and you can play with this to make the water effect a little more realistic that's totally up to you you can actually just change it around just make sure everything you see here is checked when doing so then just press OK it'll take a second and that's pretty much it. You can actually go through and erase some of these, um, some of this excess around the actual bubbles. But with that there, since this is a short tutorial video, that's how you create and well that's pretty much how you create a water effect you can actually do the same with text too with a text layer but with saying that uh, please please check out my other videos and I'll be making some more videos maybe some GIMP 101 videos I've actually been checking out uh, other people's channels and stuff and a lot of people's been asking for GIMP 101 videos and hopefully pretty soon I'll be making some soon so thanks for watching